in Tampa who is changing the way we consume coffee. Instead of pouring it into a glass, she's infusing it into desserts. ABC Action News reporter Robert Boyd has more on this Hispanic Heritage Month bond between mother and daughter. Lizette Rivera started making desserts during the pandemic as a hobby until her mother started passing out these brownies to friends and family without her even knowing. And now it's a business. So we infuse all our baked goods with espresso, whether it's the brownies or the chocolate chip cookies. We even have espresso infused snickerdoodles. Many of Lizette Rivera's recipes can be traced back to her mother Rose and their Cuban family roots. You know, she would tell me like, OK, this needs to be a little stronger in our culture. Like we really want to taste that that coffee in the brownie. Rose, who lives with dementia, would always ask Lizette to put the treats in a box for her to take home. I didn't know she was putting it on stoops of people that either had COVID, didn't really have family. It turns out the feedback was just as strong as the espresso itself and roasted whisk was born. You're going to automatically taste that little sassy Cuban flavor. Are you also going to get the pick me up that people so badly need when they drink coffee? <laughs> Yes, I've I've had that a lot. Like, should I eat this after six o'clock? Is it OK? I'm like, well, go buy the rules that you have for caffeine. Lizette got the idea from her mom to sell the desserts in special boxes, which include a little gift like a mug or candle. Make people feel like when they got it, that they were sitting here in the kitchen with me having coffee, just talking because it does bring people together. In recognition of Dementia Awareness Month, Lizette introduced a special forget me not box. And they're just in support of I love someone with dementia. With proceeds going to the Dementia Society of America. I can't tell you the number of people around me, um, friends, family that have said that their loved one, a parent, a grandparent has dementia. Each box lets the recipient know we understand what they're going through. It means so much to me that I could I could do this business in her honor. In Tampa, Robert Boyd, ABC Action News.